what was that? Hey guys, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. If you are new, thank you so much for clicking on this video. I hope you like and subscribe and watch many more. And if you're a returning viewer, click or subscriber, OG, thank you a little bit extra. Finally, finally, it's here. But before we jump in real quick, real quick, I have my mini spoilers and my premium spoilers linked down below for you if you haven't seen them already. Also, shameless self promo, I have my new um, Noella Lashes Instagram down below as well. I am launching my own brand on Halloween. I am so excited and I'm wearing one of the styles right now. So if you like what you see, if you want to go ahead and support our small business, a small startup business, that would mean so, so much to me. And I'll leave the Instagram handle down below. These should be available on Halloween if everything goes according to plan. And if you're curious about all of that, just make sure you subscribe and hit your notification bell because I will be uploading a reveal video probably on Halloween, if not a day or two beforehand. So we'll figure all that out when it gets closer to it. So, but if you're interested, it would mean a lot to me if you thumbs up this video, subscribed and hit your notification bell and followed my Instagram account. So this one poor girl on freaking Instagram must be getting so many messages I can't even explain. Connor and I have been freaking out. We're waiting for her to unbox this. She finally got her mystery box. So she ordered the premium and the deluxe. Today is gonna be about the deluxe box. The $100 box, which is eight Jeffree Star cosmetics items. Two of those are exclusive items. We don't know if they're makeup or if they're merch yet. I feel like with this, it's definitely going to be merch, especially because I feel like these are way more impromptu, like last minute, let's get rid of some stock for the year kind of thing, which I don't care. I'm still excited about. And I also did just want to say that if I ever seem ungrateful, if I give my opinion about something that is in this mystery boxes and I think it's boring or kind of like lackluster, please don't take that the wrong way. I buy these with my own money. I am really grateful that I am able to purchase them, that I'm in a financial place where I can. I know not everyone can. Even with him lowering the prices a little bit more, I am grateful. I just also want to give my opinion and, you know, and I feel like that's partially why you guys are here. Like, what do you what do I think of the items that he gave, you know? So it's all in good fun. It is just makeup. And if you don't know as well, I will be doing a giveaway once I receive the items. So these are just spoilers. I don't even have my tracking information yet. I don't know when I will be getting the un my actual unboxings up. I'm hoping really soon, but I really don't know. And I, there's not that many videos up yet anyway. So I really have no idea if it's just taking a little bit longer to ship out. If COVID has anything to do with that, I don't know. I will be doing my own unboxings videos for now. We're just enjoying the spoilers and like speculating on what we could get. If I get all the boxes at once, I'll do it in one video. But if not, I will do a video each day. I get a box and then announce the final giveaway rules at the end of the last video. I feel like that makes the most sense until there's no confusion. So just make sure you stay tuned for that. My friend Connor's doing the same thing. I always have her videos when you do something similar or Jeffree Star videos down below. So make sure you go check her out as well and like her video, subscribe to her, hit your notification bell for her so that you don't miss her giveaway either in case you don't win mine. So I guess that's all I have to say to like preface this video. If you have any like last minute ooh, speculations of what you think might be in it, leave it down below in the comments. I'm curious if your guess is right. So let's just go ahead and get into the spoilers. I just finished watching this girl's story. I recorded it, took pictures. Let's go. Let's go. I thought my cat was behind me. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my God. I called it. That's all I got to say. That's all I got to say about one item. Sorry. Okay. I'm pumped. Okay. So I'm going to insert the pictures. The first thing that she got, and of course, I'm going to leave this girl's Instagram. Go follow her. Go like her. Blah, 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 blah. So the first thing is oh, actually a wicked cool t-shirt. It's a black and orange t-shirt, which goes with the beanie if you also got the premium box, which I love. I think that's so cool. So it's black and it has this star logo, but it's like a spider web. And it looks like it has, it's not like, is it acid wash? Is that what it is? It's not tie dye, but it's similar. It's like, I think that's what it is. It's like acid wash or like bleach wash, whatever. So that's the front and the back is really cool too. It has a bigger logo and it has the acid wash on the back. I think that is so sick. I'm actually so excited for that shirt. I like that it doesn't have any weird writing or, and the logo is not like too like in your face. This is definitely my favorite like merch, mystery box merch item for sure. So then we have a lip gloss. It's like a pale pink, which is awesome. That goes with anything. So definitely something that anyone who was just purchasing this box just to like purchase some items. Definitely, I like that it has like a nice pale pink gloss. Like I said, I love his gloss formula. And then we have a lip scrub, which I honestly, I love his lip scrubs. I have, 
I can't see the name from here, but I think it's Rainbow Sorbet. I really like his lip scrubs and I'm actually really excited that it's in the box. And this is in strawberry. I remember in one mystery box, people were getting like a cucumber mint or something, which don't get me wrong, it's definitely refreshing, but I like the sweeter one. So I'm definitely glad that we didn't get kind of like a boring flavor. I think everyone for the most part likes strawberry. Also, can we talk about this girl's nails? They're like impeccable. Who does her nails, bitch? All right, let's keep going. It gets better, it gets better. Then we have the Calabasas Lip Liner, which is a beautiful shade. I have it. It's like Calabasas is like the beautiful, like kind of cool toned, deep pink. It's very similar to Androgyny. They're like literally my two favorite colors. Androgyny is definitely more cool toned and deeper, but it's a beautiful, not like two in your face pink. So I have it right here. So let me do a swatch. Oh, oh my God, I broke it just like she did. So that's what Calabasas looks like. It's freaking beautiful. I'm really excited to have a backup if that's what I get, of course. And I'm excited for another glass. Oh, I, mm. Then we have designer blood, which is really similar to unicorn blood. So that may upset some people, but again, it's a deep vampy red, which I really like. I mean, obviously it fits the theme of Halloween and fall and winter, honestly. So I feel like even though these boxes don't necessarily scream Halloween, like completely not with like crazy out of the box shades, this is actually, I think, the most wearable, like, so far for lip colors and stuff. So I do actually like that. So that is super exciting. Then we have what looks like a mystery box exclusive item. Packaging is definitely unique, and I don't think, and I think the packaging of the box is its own, and I've never seen the lip ammunition in the black packaging right here, and it's a weirdo in a lip ammunition, which I think is so freaking cool and that goes with the weirdo lip liner if any of you guys got that which by the way a lot of people were commenting if you got the weirdo lip liner those are also eye safe so you can also use that as an eyeliner which is awesome so keep that in mind don't be discouraged if you get a lip liner that you don't love because you can also use it on your eyes so but i think that is so freaking sick i cannot wait and what a oh my god i obviously just love black but what a cool like collector's item i am so excited for that honestly, and I'll use that every year around Halloween. Oh, love it. Then we got an Extreme Frost. I can't see the uh, shade and I'm not sure if that she said it, but I'm so excited. We got a freaking Extreme Frost. That was like the main thing I wanted. These are so expensive, you guys. I cannot wait to add up and do the value for this box. I am so excited. And then this better be the box I get. I just gotta say, if there's variations, I want this one. <laughs> Then we have the Bloodlust palette. I also called this, I literally texted Connor today and I was like, I guarantee you Bloodlust is gonna be it. I just have a feeling, I feel like it's his most Halloween-y palette and I feel like it would be something where it was not too recent but recent enough where he's gonna wanna like get rid of some stock of it, you know what I mean? So I am so excited, I already own Bloodlust so if I get this, this is for sure gonna be in the giveaway. I really like Bloodlust, honestly. It's a beautiful color story and definitely like the purples and the blacks, it's definitely like a Halloween vibe. So I am just so excited. All right, let me scoot back over here. <laughs> I forgot to say the value of the box. So you paid $100 and already alone, the Bloodlust palette and the Extreme Frost is over $100. So just those two items already make up for it. And I can't even guess what the t-shirt would cost at retail or the exclusive lip ammo. So the box is valued at at least $188, definitely more than that which I think is a great value and I personally really like the items. So what do you guys think? I swear I better get this variation, please. The makeup gods, please answer my prayers. I want this variation, even though I'm gonna be giving some of it away, but I do love the t-shirt. I really wanna give away Bloodlust because I do like that palette and I feel like that'd be something really cool to give back to you guys. And the Extreme Frost, sorry, if I get Extreme Frost, I'm keeping it, I'm keeping it. I'm so excited let me know what you guys think if you have any other predictions and maybe other variations let me know down in the comments below i am just gonna shut up because i'm gonna edit this and upload it as soon as i freaking can so please make sure you thumbs up this video subscribe hit the notification bell all that good stuff and thank you so much for watching i hope i see you in my next video bye guys